It's extremely quick and easy to score a shed with the raculator. Simply grab your raculator, press new, and follow the directions. The first measurement the raculator is going to ask you for is spread, and since we're only dealing with one antler, we'll simply press step to skip it. Now it's asking us for circumferences. So we're going to take our first one here, go to the circumference that the raculator is asking for, and hook the clip back on the tape. Take the slack out and engage the lock button. Unhook the tape and insert the tape back in to the raculator. After we're done that, press sub to the next one, press sub to the next one, and press sub to the next one. After circumferences, we're gonna press step and it's gonna ask us for a main beam measurement. We're gonna start by putting our pointer to the burr or the base of the shed, working it all the way up in the middle outside, rolling it all the way to the tip. Now that our main beam is measured, I'm gonna go and press step and it's telling me to measure tine one, which is the brow tine. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is put your pointer right at the tip of the tine, then we're gonna roll it down where your tine meets your main beam. Now that time one is measured, we're gonna press sub to move on to time two. After we're done the measurements for this, we'll press sub again until all our typical times are measured. So after we're done measuring our typical times, we're gonna press step on our raculator. That's gonna ask us to measure non-typical times, but we don't have any, so we simply press score, and the raculator instantly gives us a score on our shed antler. And it's just that easy. In about a minute, I can accurately answer what's that score.